I stop? I won't be, I don't know when I pick it up again. Oh. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, everything between outside of it. I'm Sophia, and welcome back to a new video. So today, we're gonna do something that I haven't done in a while. So what I used to do is I would read the book and then watch the adaptation, and then I would kind of compare and see, you know, how similar it is, or is it a good adaptation, because I have had some where it was terrible and it was just not worth watching. Yeah, and I kind of stopped doing that because I genuinely thought that, because I thought it was genuinely something that you guys didn't enjoy. But I asked on my Instagram here, on my bookstagram, if you guys were interested in me doing this for Daisy Jones and the Six, because that's obviously very current right now, and I haven't read Daisy Jones and the Six yet, just because I never thought it would be a miale. Also, a literal babe had informed me that the episodes are released weekly, so you have, I think, the first three episodes, then and again three episodes, and then two in the last two. I have the book is with the movie cover, sadly, but honestly, I do prefer these over any of the other Daisy Jones and the Six covers, and don't come for me on that. I kept seeing the trailer of this when I was in England, so I'm really, really excited. I have no clue what it's about, only that it's about a rock band in the 70s, I believe, or just a band, and that the entire book is told in interviews. And that is going to probably make it so much easier to read. I love when it's not like just typical fonts and normal writing. So I got my tabs. These are um, my darker tabs because I just feel like these will fit with the cover. I'm going to have to read this book like properly paying attention. I'm on page 10. That is not a good start. I thought I was on page like 20, but um, I think I wanna get to page, let's see, 49, because that's at the end of this chapter. I'm just gonna read and see where I'm gonna get with this because I, my goal was to get through like majority of this today, but guess not. I do have free a lot more than I thought tomorrow because my math got canceled, so I'm gonna take that to my advantage. Stop writing such good lines. I can't keep I can't underline the entire book. I finished the other chapter, so I'm now on page 43, but that's enough for tonight. I swear to god, I'm about to fall asleep. But I'm actually enjoying it. I've been enjoying it. Sometimes it's a bit more interesting than other times, but that's just the way it's gonna be. But so far, I'm enjoying it. I don't want to say I'm necessarily like super intrigued if I know more, but it's definitely interesting. But the quotes are amazing. I will say that. I need to get some fucking sleep. I swear. Not the last time I filmed. Um, but it's been a while. Today is Friday, March 10th, I believe. I have been getting through Daisy Jones and the Six. The only thing is, is that it's been hard. It's been difficult for me to get through it. Not really focusing on reading it. I've been reading different books in between. Already started different videos and stuff like that. Just because, I'm gonna be really honest with you guys, I'm just not interested. When I watch reviews, when I watch interviews or like anything related to somebody else, then I will be interested because I want to hear more about them. And the only times I'm slightly interested if there's a little bit of drama, but it's not like I pick it up and I'm, <laughs> I pick it up and I'm super excited to hear what's going to come next and you know, how they're going to meet and all that stuff. I'm not crazy for on the book. I uh, downloaded the audiobook as well on Audible because... I was just like, this is going to make it so much easier for me to get through it because right now I was packing to go to my boyfriend's house and I could just listen to it. I'm over two hours. I don't really know exactly on what page I am. For being almost like one third into the book, it's just like, I would be fine with not knowing this. But on the other hand, I'm only one third. Like, what? Like, there's still so much that could potentially happen. I Once I start reading it, I do just let it, like, I just continue because I'm like, if I don't, if I stop... I won't be, I don't know when I pick it up again. My only thing is that I'm not enjoying the book right now. I don't really like Daisy. Though she's like one of the main characters, I don't like her. She's annoying. She's annoy. she annoys me. I really hope that this goes better and that I can laugh at myself. I really do because it's really embarrassing if it doesn't. Billy's a fucking dick as well. I think it gets better. I don't fucking know. I'll just keep you updated, I guess. <laughs> It 
is Monday, and yesterday I listened. Actually, for the past couple of days, I've just been listening to a lot of um, the audiobook. I know normally when I do, like, reading vlogs or stuff like this, I would be a lot more active when I'm, like, reading. I would, you know, stop and tell my reactions and really, like, show you reactions. But obviously, I've been listening to it rather than reading it. I don't think I've picked up the physical book since, like, page, like, I don't know, like, 90 or something. And I'm on page 301 now, so I have, like, 85 pages left. I do kind of want to, in a way, finish the book physically, reading it physically. But on the other hand, I think I'll just get bored. I am still not interested in the story. Like, I was just waiting for, like, the main climax to happen. I'm not really following the plot. Maybe I miss something. Like, obviously, I, I understand that it's all about the band and the connections, in, like, in, within the band and, like, the band and the band members, like, family and all that stuff. I don't know. I was expecting someone to, like, die or something. I know that doesn't make sense because they're, like, interviews, but I was like, maybe somebody dies. I don't know. Fucking... I don't know, I was waiting for something crazy to happen. Maybe something crazy will happen in these last, like, 80 pages. I honestly don't think it will. Right now, all I can think about is that I'll be happy when I finish the book, because then all I have to do is watch the show. The show looks really interesting for some reason. I'll try to keep you guys a bit more updated in these last 80 pages, just so you guys are not confused. <laughs> That's really all I have to say for now. <laughs> oh! I'm at my workers' office. I think I've made it clear that I don't like the two main characters, Billy and Daisy. Like, for some reason, they both just piss me, piss me off. I was reading, and I was just like, fuck off. Like, I was just reading, like, shut up. Like, they're so... I have, like, 25 pages left, so I should survive this. Daisy's gonna be famous. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wat een poepoek. Even de ending was like, maar ik ben gewoon blij dat ik het eigenlijk over is. Oh, uh. Hello. It has been light years and it looks like I've been asleep for light years. I finished Daisy Jones and the Six, like, I think, like, probably like a month ago. Something like that. Like a fucking while ago. And obviously, I didn't love it. Um, but we're still gonna watch the show. I have it up already since so the first episode. This is literally my entire plan for today. Just watch as much of the show as I can. I am half an hour into the first episode. The first episode is like 47 minutes. I got myself some breakfast. I am like only paying half attention and I am bored and I just want to watch Criminal Minds. I don't know. It's just like, I don't care. That's also what I have with the book. Like, I don't care. Yeah, I'm gonna eat and watch, I guess. It's Sunday. Um, it's actually the day that I'm gonna post this video. So I watched one and a half episodes of the show on Amazon. I watched like half of the first episode yesterday and the rest I watched today. It's something I would have in the background, definitely, but I would rather have something else in the background if that makes sense. And I was talking to my mom about it because the thing is, I know the way the show goes. I know that I probably won't enjoy it to the fullest and I'll probably just have it on in the background because I need to and then I force myself to do just like anything else and that that is a bit of a waste of my time because I am just wasting my time because I, I know I'm not enjoying it. So I know I used to really just like sit through um, whatever adaptation I had to watch but that is often because I did enjoy the book and then like I was willing to give the movie a try um, but this is the first time I actually did not enjoy the book and then I had to watch the adaptation and I think that makes it a lot more difficult to actually push through in a way so obviously throughout the, <laughs> throughout the video you notice that this book was not my favorite i in the beginning i really was giving it a chance and the first 10 pages and the first 10 20 pages i already was like okay like i don't know where this is gonna go but you know i'm really early on so maybe it'll get like a lot better and there's probably like so much more i need to learn when i kind of came halfway into the book and i realized that this is just the way that the book is going to continue to go because this is the way it's written um i started to get a bit bored and definitely started slacking on reading the book itself like i would i would just like avoid reading it like i literally started reading any other book that was not daisy jones and the six so didn't have to like 
not suffer, but like I was just not enjoying it. I do feel really bad because this is such like a well-known book and so many people love this book. I can see why people would love the book and why people would feel connected to these characters or just connected to the story. If a book is very character driven, if you don't like the characters, it's not gonna go right for you. Because I think it didn't help that I listened to the audiobook because in the audiobook, um, Daisy Jones had like the, I don't know, in my opinion, I found her voice so annoying. I don't know when I'm gonna rate it either. Like, I don't wanna say it, but I think it's gonna be like a 2.5. 2.75 and I'll just round it up to a three probably um so don't get absolutely slaughtered that was it for today um I'm sorry that this video kind of sucked because I didn't enjoy the book so I was not like lovey and happy and and I was not thriving if you're still watching comment this emoji and I will see you when I see you bye